to Sean. <laughs> Anglers worldwide. I'm Jabroni Joe, so you already know I'm back with another show. And in today's video, guys, I am officially back to making content from my little hiatus, uh, welcoming my newborn son into the world. I did enjoy my time off, spending time with my family and my newborn Liam Jethro. We've had a lot of fun uh, getting to know each other over the last few weeks, but I'm really starting to get that itch, and I need to go out and catch some fish. And I really need to film it and make some videos for you guys because uh, that's just what I love to do. I do want to say thank you to everyone who sent us well wishes and congratulations on the new addition to the family. And to everyone who stuck with watching the videos and supporting the channel while I took my little break. Now that I am back full force, my creative juices are flowing at full capacity again. I have some great ideas, some great adventures that I want to take you guys on. And hopefully the next few months on the channel, the second half of the year, is going to be absolutely amazing. With that being said, we are going to take a trip to Old Reliable, the pit today, because I haven't caught a fish in three or four weeks, and if I go to the pit, I'm pretty confident that I'm going to catch at least one fish. So we're going to go launch the kayak, throw around a few different lures, see what we can find the fish biting on, and uh, hopefully have a pretty good day on the water. I'm also going to be rocking some new threads, as you guys can see, out on the water today. This is the 2023 jersey for the Oklahoma City Kayak Fishing Club, the tournament trail I've been fishing the last few months. I've been meaning to pick one of these up since I joined the tournament trail, but I just hadn't got around to it, uh, didn't have the money saved up, and my lovely wife ordered me one for Father's Day uh, just a few days before our son was born, so I just hadn't had time to uh, put it on and show you guys the new threads that I've got. It's got the OKC KFC logo on the front, and on the back it has all of our awesome sponsors, as well as customized with our names, which, of course, you know I got Jabroni Joe. This hoodie has the long sleeves with the thumb hooks to keep your sleeves down. It's very lightweight and very breathable, so on a hot day it gives you that sun protection, but it doesn't let you overheat. And, of course, you've got the hood for extra sun protection on your neck and sides of your face. These jerseys were made by another one of OKC KFC sponsors that was on the back here. That is Stay Humble OKC. Big shout out to them for making these awesome jerseys for us. Alrighty everyone, enough jaw jacking out of me. Let's go launch a kayak, get on the water, and see if we can find some fish. And I'll talk to you guys more in the outro. Let's get it everybody. First fish in the morning. Whew, not a huge one, but he took that janky jig pretty good. Nice little fish. Let's get him back in the water. Fish 
to Sean. <laughs> Oh, that's a decent fish too. Guys, look at that. <laughs> oh, guys, on the Zebco spin cast reel on a, uh, a medium light worm rod. <laughs> Man, that's a chunky fish. Look at that chunker. Woo. Man, he took that, that Cinco down to the gullet too. That was my first cast with the Cinco. Come out of that. There we go. Look at that beautiful fish. Beautiful fish. Let's get this one back in the water. Good fish. Another decent fish on the Senko. Woo! Another decent fish on the Senko. There we go, guys. Another beautiful little fish. Awesome. Awesome catch. Back to the water. That was fish number two caught on this weightless Texas rigged Senko. And it is on a Berkeley Cherry Wood medium light rod. This is a $25 rod. And this is a uh, Zebco Dock Demon reel. I took this off my son's Dock Demon because I didn't have a reel for this rod. So uh, this just goes to show that you can definitely catch some decent fish on budget gear. Oh, that's a good. Ah, oh, dang it. That was a good fish. Fish. That's fish number four. This one was on the Ned rig, and he's got 
check this out guys he's got a messed up lip right there all right fish number four for the morning not a bad day so far Fish on. There he goes. Now he's fighting. <laughs> well, not a bad one. There we go. Woo! We got this one skipping a Cinco up here in the tunnel. Skinny, but not a bad little fish. Another fish. Feels good. Well, thanks to you, but. <laughs> ah! Came off at the tire. Fish on. That one, <laughs> that one feels good. Oh, this tunnel has a lot of fish in it, apparently. Oh yeah, there's a chunky. Come here, baby. Come here, buddy. I see you. You're not getting away. <laughs> There we go. Ooh, that's a pretty fish. Look at that one, guys. Pretty fish on the Senko. <laughs> Man, this tunnel was loaded today. <laughs> oh, he came off. He came off. Dang it, that felt like a decent one. Fish on. <laughs> it's a little one, but it's a little bass. Oh wow, this thing's a baby. <laughs> Look at that little squeaker.
that's a strong fish. <laughs> Feel the little drag and everything. Come here, buddy. Come here. Keep it still. And this guy doesn't want to hold still. Yes. Come here. All right, just get to it. <sighs> There we go. Deadly Nedly. Oh, that one's got a hole. He's got a hole right here in his lip. He's been caught plenty of times. Another beautiful little fish. Back to the water. Well guys, I have to say, that was a pretty darn decent day out on the water. We caught eight or 10 fish, I kinda lost count, and we caught three or four of those fish on this in, just insane setup. It's a Berkeley Cherrywood medium light casting rod with a Zebco Dock Demon reel. My son has outgrown his Dock Demon, so I had this reel sitting around, I had this rod sitting around. I just threw this together to see you know, if I could have some fun with it. And it actually ended up being a pretty nice little combo. It skips well. Um, it's really good for a little weightless worm combo. Obviously, I'm not going to be throwing this around in a tournament unless you guys smash that like button. If I can get 100 likes on this video, I'll fish this in a tournament and see how it does. But uh, yeah, it was a fun little setup. It was a little wacky way to just get on the water, catch some fish, and have fun doing it. So if you guys have stuff like this lying around, maybe give it a shot. You never know how fun it could be. Overall guys, I'm just happy to have caught some fish today to be back to making videos for you guys and basically back to grinding it out and trying to make this dream happen. I do have some really cool ideas and adventures planned in the next few months before that cold, cold winter gets here and it's harder to catch fish. So you guys please got to stay tuned if you want to see all of the cool stuff that I have coming. And remember anglers, I set the specific goal of reaching 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2023. I truly believe that vague goals get vague results, which is why I set that specific goal of 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2023. If you guys would like to help me reach that goal, please smash that like button and body slam a comment down in the comment section. Let me know what kind of content you want to see from me so that I can make better videos for you guys. And as always, if you're not already, you gotta super kick subscribe and ring that bell icon so that you can be notified every time Jabroni Joe uploads a new video. I'll catch you guys in the next one. And remember, if it ain't Joe, it's gotta go. Angler, out.